Hey guys, Jeremy here. I am back, got the wall behind me, and got some bad news. It's literally been the age of apocalypse in terms of show cancellations. Fox has dropped a shit ton of shows in the span of a couple of days. The big ones being Lucifer and Mine that really pissed me off was Brooklyn Nine-Nine, really hoping that gets picked up by someone else. Then there's Sci-Fi that dropped The Expanse, and they're looking for a new production. And now for CW, the Wayward Sisters idea has been cancelled. It wasn't gonna happen. There supposedly was a large fan group that wanted this. Yet, the episode that, basically the one that's setting it up for it, there was a lot of people who didn't care. There were a lot of people who didn't like that episode because of how much it focused on them. And I think, I don't know, I don't know if people knew that or if they just didn't care. But really, the boys are the big reason why a lot of people go and see this show. So, I understood and I kind of, I was much more behind this idea, admittedly, than I was for their bloodline thing that they tried a while ago, but it just wasn't going to happen, guys. The show is run off of a very small budget for its size, and the lead actors, there's two lead actors, which is a huge, like, if you look at certain shows, like look at the Big Bang Theory, right? That's a huge, that's like five guys, and they all want a shit ton of money. The brothers don't because they have investments through the show itself. So they make their money through that on the side as well as they are the two big guys. So everyone else is paid like eh, but in real comparison, no one's a regular besides the two brothers. So when you have five of them, that's already a lot of money on the table. And so that was probably one of the key factors as well as possibly this just wasn't something that CW saw. And considering that this might be a sign of the times that Supernatural might not be continuing after season 14, but we'll see what happens. It all depends on really the ratings of the show now with just the amount of retcons and the writing style that's happened. It really depends on what happens to Supernatural, but I'm pretty sure that they're never going to try a spin-off idea again after this. Anyways, it sucks, but hey, a lot of other people are suffering when there's a lot of other shows that are getting cancelled too. So anyways guys, that's all for me. Hope you enjoyed this vid. Sorry that for the bad news, but I thought I'd talk about it, give my opinion, and for those of you who are upset that this is ha not happening, I'm sorry, that sucks for you guys. For me, eh, you know, I wasn't going to probably watch it, but now there's a storyline that will be forever just hidden and never be able to be finished. Oh, by the way, some of you who are saying, well, have Netflix take it, yeah, that's not going to happen. CW owns the property. Supernatural, those girls are, the whole show premise is within the Supernatural universe. They own that property, so that's not going to happen. Anyways, that's all for me. I'll see you guys next time.